Neil and welcome to yet another video and unsurprisingly it's another double IPA tonight and it's this one from Left Handed Giant and Garage Beer Co. It's a collaboration called Easy Tiger and it's potent shall we say um, there are stronger dippers out there it's 8.3% but I like what it tells me it tells me the hop content is Simcoe Equinot and Amarillo. The malts are Marisotta Extra Pale, Oats, Wheat and Carapils. Yeast is London Fog and it's got Dextrose in there for a bit of sweetness as well. So, yeah, this is quite a smart looking little can, you know. Bit of a tiger going on. Yeah, it is what it is. But it's quite pleasant. I like tigers. I like big cats. Fair jags, but tigers are, they're up there. Anyway, the flavour profile could be pr pretty impressive based on the hot content. So I'm expecting a lot. Now, I've seen a few reviews of this and it's mixed, I'll be honest. Some people seem to really dig it, others are less keen. But got no reason to say I'm gonna dislike it so let's crack it open and see if it is worth the six pound 25 that I paid for it so let's give it a pour Ooh, looks like it's, it's very pale very pale quite clear as well as dippers go say modern dippers It is not very hazy. It's not well, it's certainly not murky, put it that way. A little bit hazy. It smells good. It smells very familiar. But then again, any kind of strong dipper with this kind of hot content will smell smell very similar. So I'm expecting good things. It smells slight ever so slightly savoury. Yeah, but like I say, I'm, I'm quite surprised by the colour. I was expecting it to be murkier, slightly darker than it is. Don't know why, but just was. Anyway, what it is all about is the taste. So let's see what we get. Mm. Okay, I'm getting the savoury element. getting bitterness which is very nice and there's something I'm getting in the middle there is a sweetness it's probably the way to describe it that comes through kind of just to balance the, the bitterness out a little bit I can taste all, all 8.3% in there. It doesn't hide it, but in the same vein, it doesn't scream at you as being 8.3%. It's definitely there. Yeah, I like that. I like that. Like I say, savoury up front, bitterness and sweet. It's not overly fruity. I can't... Well, no, I can't say I'm getting anything particularly fruity in there at all. I'm getting savoury notes up front. I've heard some people sort of describe some beers as having a slight onion overtone. And I get what they mean. You know when you cook onions down and they become quite sweet? Getting a tiny, tiny touch of that sort of thing going on. It's going to sound quite pretentious, but I think this would go lovely with a plate of cheese and biscuits. It really would. Mm. That is a cracker, actually. 
The more you drink it, the sweetness kind of prevails over everything else. And it's it's dangerously easy to drink. And at 8.3%, you don't want to drink it too quick. Mm. Yeah, I like that. I do like that. So would I buy it again? There is a good question. Yeah, I would. I mean, I've got absolute metric fuck ton of beer to get through at the minute. Excuse my French. Um, but yes, I would buy it again. In the immediate future, would it rank up there with my favourites? It's a good question. I like it because it's subtly different to everything else. It's not your big murky juice bomb of a dipper, you know. Not like your Verdant Howl and whatnot. And the uh, there may be one more PSI, which I absolutely adore. It is different. It's the same style, it's a dipper, but it offers something very different. And I like different. And it's, it's if you think of like a painting and a palette of colours, it is just a, a different shade of that colour that means you can paint a better picture. And with this style of dipper on offer, it means you can still stick to what you like, but have something that complements what you already love with something ever so subtly different and yet familiar. And I think that's the key thing to take away from Easy Tiger, is it's familiar, but different in a good way. So on that glorious note, I'm going to go and enjoy the rest of this beer and leave you all to the rest of your evening. So thank you very much for watching. This has been Left Hand Giant and Crate Brewing Co's Easy Tiger. I've been Nick and I will see you again soon. Bye.